Riding a bicycle is a great way to stay in shape. However, one Utah man is taking it to an extreme. After 32 heart procedures, Utah resident Bob Quick has been riding his bicycle across the country, thanking first responders. He's been doing this since 2012. Our Reed Gregory tells us how Bob Quick paid the St. Joseph Fire Department a visit just this morning. If it wasn't for these absolutely amazing men and women, okay, the brother and sisterhood of firefighters around the world, uh, I wouldn't be alive. Bob Quick isn't your average 61 year old. He spends his free time pedaling across the country on his bicycle and giving thanks to first responders after being diagnosed with a life altering heart condition. When Quick got the diagnosis that his heart and his kidneys were both in stage three failure, he figured there's no better time than to start giving thanks than right now. In 2012, I asked my doctor, I says, doc, I said, I've been cooking for the firehouses locally now for a few years. I said, what would you say if I wanted to ride a bicycle across America thanking first responders? He says, what's stopping you? After 32 heart procedures, 20 stents, and a pacemaker, Bob Quick won't give up. Since then, Quick has seen himself across the nation multiple times, thanking first responders with one of his bicycles, even ending up at Ground Zero in New York City. Being in St. Joseph this morning was a small stop in Quick's journey, as he'll continue heading east to drop off a signed bike in Kentucky and then continue onward until he reaches South Carolina. I will finish in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, but in two weeks, I will be in Lexington, Kentucky, handing off the bicycle to another firefighter. Then I will get on another bicycle and continue. Before Quick got the chance to leave St. Joseph, the St. Joseph Fire Department made sure he got at least one last souvenir to remember them by. We'd like to present you with this retired helmet just to show our appreciation for oh. you recognizing us. Thank you so much, Chief. You that bet. brings tears to my eyes. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. With his next heart operation scheduled for here in the next six months, Quick said he's back to finish as many rides as possible because you never leave something unfinished. Anybody that has any kind of medical training knows that that window of me surviving is getting very, very narrow. So we're back to finish that ride. You never leave something unfinished. Reporting in St. Joseph, Reed Gregory, News Press Now.